Now back here in South Korea and prosecutors have started raiding offices and firms implicated in a corruption scandal in involving one of President Park Geun-hye's senior secretaries and a special inspector who had been investigating the aid. Our Oh jung -hee has the details. Lee seok -soo, who is currently under investigation along with a top presidential aide, expressed his intention to resign on Monday. The news came after state prosecutors raided eight places on the same day as part of an ongoing probe into a corruption scandal involving Woo byung senior presidential secretary for civil affairs, and Lee, who is suspected of leaking classified information of his investigation as a special inspector on Woo. He said he decided to leave his post as carrying out with his duties normally would be impossible after Monday's confiscation. I don't think it's right to keep working as a special inspector following today's confiscation. Prosecutors are soon to summon and question me, so I will do my part as a citizen and cooperate with them. Earlier in the day, a special investigation team confiscated hard disks and various documents from E's office, as well as a real estate company run by the family of Wu's wife. The raid also included a Seoul Metropolitan Police Agency office. This is the first time in Korea's prosecution history that two high-profile figures are probed simultaneously. Despite calls for his resignation, Wu still remains in his position at the top office. The senior civil affairs secretary is suspected of exerting influence in helping his son get special treatment while carrying out his mandatory military service, while his wife's family members are accused of shady deals with an online game maker. Special Inspector Yi, who was looking into the allegations against Wu, also came under fire after he was reported to have leaked information related to his ongoing case to an unspecified journalist, which represents a breach of the law if proven to be true. Oh Jung-hee, Arirang News.